all my work, if it's graphic design or, or anything, centers around sound. I like to work with things that are already there, uh, reuse it. It gets faster, huh? Yeah. Ah, oh, but this time it didn't come on. Did you do anything? Jan normally comes up with a project and he has a little list of people he would invite. So for something like this, which is untried um, and very experimental, you'll pick me because I'm quite good at taking risks with stuff and experimenting. When you take an object and you change it a little and make it into a sound object, I was curious if you could do that on different levels. So I wondered if you do it with a vacuum cleaner, could you do it with a train station? Or could you do it with the streets, the city? Um, so for me, that is that a, a, a working method that you can use on different levels? And per level what sort of rules are applied. Neither of us are musicians but we enjoy sound and sound is everywhere. And what we enjoy and what we find is engaging for the public is when you use items which they're familiar with, that they use every day and they're familiar with the sound but yet they never imagined that it could be a creative sound or something that's engaging. This is purely our first stage of working. So we start off curious and then we, we find things. And then when we find things, we start thinking. This is Discovery Channel you know, for us, that's it.